these are the game pieces for the Skittles game. As you can see, the blank has been mounted on the machine and turned down using a roughing gouge. In my hand, I have a stencil or a template that I have marking. That would be the width of the game piece. And also, I have one that I have turned before. These will be very helpful in acquiring the shape of the piece on the lathe. The ends of the game piece have been marked with a parting tool. The parting tool is placed on the tool rest and the, hand, the back handle is gently lifted up as the cutting face moves into the lathe, the piece on the lathe. This can be then shaped back over with the roughing gouge. It may need further turning with the parting tool again to continuously mark the line. However, this will become more easier to you as time goes by. From a piece that I made earlier, I was able to mark the center lines that have the design on them. These can be marked with a pencil. Generally, a soft one is preferable as they do not break as, as easily. I am then scoring these lines with the parting tool again gently by lifting the back handle into the air and facing the cutting face into the tool. Using the bowl gouge or spindle gouge, I can cut down my piece to the desired shape along with the help of my template. Here I am offering, or offering up the template that I have made for the previous game piece, which will see the thickness of the game piece fall into it. I can also offer up the game piece to check to see if they match one another. 